Hannah and welcome back to my channel. Now today I will be bringing a new kind of video to you guys. I say that in every video just because every video I do is new and I always feel like it's something that I wouldn't do. So today is really something I kind of really wouldn't do. It's my unpopular opinions video. I usually don't give my opinion with things like I'm usually like a mouse, I'm quiet. But I feel as though there's some things I gotta get off my chest and I should say and if you don't agree with me don't try to argue with me in the comments because everybody has their own kind of opinion my opinion might not be your opinion so without further ado let's just get right into this video so my first unpopular opinion is NBA Youngboy everybody around me always listens to him I'd be so mad because just like he not even all of that like when he first came out like he was trash like you can't even understand what he's saying and it's just like why you look like that like i know some girls think that he's so cute but i don't even think that he's that cute i might be like a little biased because like when he first came out i didn't really mess with him but now like he's kind of growing on me because like i live in a city where everybody just listens to him everybody you know what what part of new jersey you're from like everybody listens to him so it was like i don't have like barely none of his songs downloaded on my phone but i listen to him so much from other people like listen to him and i'm just around that i be knowing all his songs and it's just like okay and it's like i'm not even hating off him or nothing like that it's just that like I just don't like you like I'm sorry like can I not like you like I don't know I kind of like like him a little bit now like not that not that much not that really I don't know what I'm talking about but yeah I just like he's just I just like he's not attractive to me his music's not all of that like he raps about the same things like uh, I just like the the one song that I came to serve it that's long that one song yeah that's my shit okay my second unpopular opinion is eggs are just nasty like they're just nasty and i really don't like eggs because it's just like why eggs so nasty like when i was younger i used to eat eggs but now just like i don't know if like my taste buds changed over the years maybe or not but like people always want to eat eggs and i don't eat eggs like people be like oh what you want for breakfast i just be like i'll eat pancakes and bacon like that's about it like i won't be trying to eat nothing else just pancakes and freaking bacon like and i'd be so i'd be so mad at my own so because like damn why why don't i like like why don't i like eggs like why isn't it fair for me i just be like i'm only eating two things like let me get extra meat let me get a little hash brown let me get some more wheat okay but not no eggs like when i eat eggs like i really just want to throw up like the smell of eggs it's just like oh no baby curl like no, me. okay so i might like get like roasted in the comments for this one but i really feel as though emma chamberlain and antonio garza like they're overrated sis they've been overrated always overrated and i feel like antonio garza copying emma chamberlain and it's like emma chamberlain she's not even all that like out of like who their little group like james Ta charles the dawson twins like emma chamberlain she's like my least favorite like I like the Dawson twins, they're cute. A lot of people say like they don't they're not really into them, but I think they're cute. James Charles, I, I still like him, even with all his little scandals going around. But Amber Chamberlain, like she's like my least favorite one out of all of them because like she just does too much editing in her freaking videos. She's not making it funny. Like if he didn't do all those edits in her videos, her videos would be pointless. It would just be her like regular vlogging and like it like it makes a difference because she's like editing them like differently like with dramatic pauses like how i'm doing with zoom ins cheeky screens sound effects like that's what she does like that's her whole life props to my sis because she's making it her life so kudos to you and antonio garza you're doing the same thing as her but worse and you're gonna come up off of it which you are congratulations to you but i just feel like you they're overrated i feel like that's like kind of childish i just think that they're they're too high up on the peak where they need to just be like down here you feel me so i really feel as though chipotle isn't all that like people always say oh my god i love chipotle like no sis first of all i don't even mess with chipotle because i filled a job application there and they didn't even hire a bitch and then i came back to where i was from from school and they want to call me and i'm like i'm not there no more so don't try to call me now when i needed the job and you want to give me the job their food is good like, it's okay like saying all that but i really feel like it's similar to moe's and if you were blindfold somebody and put chipotle and moe's next to them i really feel like 
they wouldn't even know the difference for real for real their pods overrated like they're overrated as fuck like I'm talking about i don't speak broke bitch you're broke after buying them fucking airpods you spend hundreds of dollars on wireless headphones when wired headphones work just as good as unwired headphones and if that's the case and if you really want a pair of airpods you might as well go on a cheaper thingy and get the android one because they work just good as good as the airpod as the iphone ones that's trying to get hundred dollars off of them and you might as well buy the fifty dollar ones save you a couple hundred dollars and then if they break you don't buy another one and if they don't break you just made it come up blue face blue face is really trash like i don't know why people like him so much because like but that, like i get it like it's the song is catchy when it first came i'm like oh lord like th like this uh it's a head nod, like it's a head nod, but that's all it is. Like, did you really like listen to like some of the words he be saying? Like, do y'all hear what he be saying? Like, oh, it's not even there. Like, I just can't even explain it for real. It's just like, you gotta listen to the song cause I'm not about to play the song in this video cause YouTube is not about to copy strike me. He's really trash. Like, Tatiana is like his only really good song. Like, that's what's carrying him. If it wasn't for that one song, he would still be unknown person. Like, I like the little dance he be doing. Like, the little dance, like, that's my job. <laughs> I don't know if this is an unpopular opinion. I just don't like steak or A1 sauce. Like, and I, oh. I feel like people think like that's just a good combination, a good duo, but I just never understood it. Like A1 sauce, steak, like it's just not there for me. Like it never was. Cause first of all, I don't know if I'm just not eating the right kind of steak. I don't know. <laughs> like, I just don't say I just don't like steak. Like it's too rough. A1 sauce got this little tangy little taste. Like it didn't even balance each other. I was like, who made those? Two things to go with each other. I don't know who did it, but they were wrong. Like they were good with the peanut butter and jelly, milk and cereal, you want sauce and steak. Like whoever was, they thought that was the one, like it wasn't. So I need you to take that back, put it back in the lab, and try to like recreate a sauce for steak that's probably gonna help it. But I'm still not fucking with steak though. All right. So for this next one, please, 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 please don't come for me in the comments because i love everybody everybody makes their own decisions in their life okay but i feel like young pregnant girls like it just i feel like if you're gonna get pregnant be pregnant and smart about it don't be pregnant and young and dumb in love and thinking you're gonna get pregnant and somebody's gonna love you because you're pregnant no sis he's still gonna leave you he's still gonna do him he's still gonna do all the bullshit that he was doing before while before you were pregnant and while you're pregnant and after you're pregnant unless y'all are in a committed relationship and even so you are too young to be pregnant like i feel like if like you're not 18, don't get pregnant, like, straight like that. Even young 18-year-olds, I'm 21, I still wouldn't get pregnant. I'm gonna have my life together, like, I'm a whole college student. And I feel like when you're pregnant, like, it's a whole step back in your life. Like, it's not a step back in a bad thing, but, like, you're gonna wanna do you and do things that you wanna do, but you're gonna have to provide for a whole nother baby that, like, it's not, it's not gonna be about you anymore. It's like, you can't have a baby and still trying to be a baby. That's just some things that you have to think about. So I'm not knocking anybody that's pregnant or has a kid that is young. Do you kudos to you? Cause I couldn't do it, like I really couldn't. But I feel like it's just, it couldn't be me. It couldn't be me. Expensive clothes, okay? So my popular opinion with expensive clothes is like, you don't need to have expensive clothes to look good like half my clothes are cheap as fuck and i look good people always ask me where i buy it from and i buy it from majority of the time aliexpress or furry 21 or thrift store like that's really basically it like i don't do no high end shopping because i don't have the money for it now when i do get the money for it like i will buy like expensive things but i'm still gonna be trying to save a little coins you might see me a little designer here a little designer there but overall i'm not gonna be buying no expensive stuff like no gucci no louis no fendi no prada like Maybe a little something, but not all that. I just feel like you don't need expensive clothes to look good. You can wear a lot. It's just how you put it together. That's all I can say. Just how you put stuff together. It's just... That's it. <laughs> Cup of noodles are better than pack of noodles. I said it. I said it. Yes, I said it. I said it. I said it. Cup of noodles are better than pack of noodles. I don't know what you said. I don't know if this is just the packaging, how it's coming to me. I don't know, but like... It's just better. Like, I don't know if it's a mind thing. Like, since it's in a cup, I feel like it's better. Like, the little, the little, little, um, 
vegetables they put in them them shits artificial as hell but like i don't eat them shits i don't really care but the cup the cup though the cup like i don't know even if i don't got no freaking if all i got is pack noodles i'm gonna put it in a bowl i'm gonna put it in well obviously i'm gonna put it in a bowl i'm gonna put it like in one of like you know the uh chinese takeout containers i'm gonna put it on one of them you know my chopstick be a little fancy you feel me but i just feel like cup noodles it back is better than cup noodles and egg noodles you know how about better try to argue in the comments if you want you're gonna lose because i can argue that to death i don't care what you say like i don't care if you're trying to be like oh you put it in the stove or other stuff or like oh you don't put it in the microwave or you put it in the microwave like everybody has different preference it's just my opinion I like Pope in my orange juice. I don't care like if it's like just regular orange juices, but I would prefer Pope in my orange juice. It's because I don't know. I like the way it tastes. Is that weird? Like that I like the way it tastes. Like it, it, it do a little something for me. I just like it. Like it just makes it feel like it's more natural. Like I just squeezed a fresh orange. Like that's how I like it. Sometimes with the ones like when you know like if it has Pope in it, you know that that's like it's fresh. Like it's fresh or with any brand though, not just with like no Tropicana or other stuff. Like with any brand, if it has Pope in it, I just believe that it's fresh. I don't know if it's a fact. I just believe in my head like that it's just fresher. But if it's a regular some ordinary orange juice, that shit is just artificial as hell. But if it has Pope in it, I hope they ain't put no artificial Pope in the orange juice like that. This is my last one. And I really feel as though Playboy Cardi, yes, you guys know, I love Playboy Cardi. Look, look, you see it? Like, I know you guys see it. You guys see this? Yes, I know. And I have the tattoo on my ass. So, mm, go on my Instagram, follow my Instagram at Mina Savage. Ooh, I'm wrong. Savage XO underscore underscore. That's my Instagram name. He doesn't get the rest of the that he deserves. Like, I editing mina here and i don't even know what i just said like that was what like recognition girl recognition I care like if i'm just dick right because i love him that's my man he's on my phone case he's every freaking where i'm gonna get posters of him yes you see my little poster collection oh hold on pause video for a second let me do a little interruption so i made these paintings yesterday i know this has nothing to do with my video but i just want to show you guys my paintings so i made this one Hey, hey, this is the second one I made. Do you like it? Comment in the chat if you like this one. And then this one, I like this one. Uh, like this video if you like this one. This was the first one. This is the first painting I ever made. For this to be the first painting I ever made, and it's going to be the second painting I ever made in the same video, I feel like I did a pretty damn good job. But back to why Playboy Cardi is irrelevant. He doesn't get the rest he deserves. Now, I know some people don't like mumble rappers. Okay, that's fine. My whole thing is my rappers. My top five rappers are Playboy Cardi, Trippy Red, Juice Roll, Comethazine, and whoever else I like. I don't really know who else I like. I don't know. Who's my phone right now? I don't know. But those are my top, okay? Like, if you follow me, follow me. Oh, I like YB and Namir. There we go. But, oh, Uzi, 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 Uzi. <laughs> I, like, I like a lot of rappers, but I'm a rappers. I fuck with them, like, hardcore. Like, I feel like mom rappers are, like, rap, but kind of, like, try to be, they try to be rock stars, you feel me? Like, should be play with Cardi, they be trying to be rock stars. If you like Mangolia, that means that you just like that one song, you don't know nothing about play with Cardi. But, like, I know people don't like him because you can't understand nothing he's saying and, like, his shit's not lyrical. But his music isn't lyrical music. It's supposed to be for the beat and the producing part. Like, you're not there for lyrical shit. You're there for the vibe, the producing, the, like, the, just, just the all, like, <sighs> if you fuck with Play Ricardo, you fuck with him. And if you don't, you ain't a real nigga, period. So, that's all I have to say about that. I really hope you guys like this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Comment down below what's your unpopular opinion. What's something that people don't agree with you with. So, yeah. I love you guys so, so, so much. Please get this video to, I don't know, 20 likes. I don't really know. But, yeah. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.